When I talk to people about coaching and how they might benefit, I easily get caught up in the words because there's so much to say about coaching. I'm going to simplify it for you so that you can make a more informed decision about what to expect. I'd say motivation is fundamental to the coaching relationship. It's pretty much a waste of time, money, and energy if you aren't motivated to change. So how do we change? By firstly being comfortable with our coach and exploring possibilities and choices while becoming aware of our obstacles or whatever gets in our own way. Oftentimes these are external, like bosses, colleagues, family members, partners or friends, pretty much anyone. This is where I come in, to help you recognize the gremlins, inner critics, or whatever you'd like to call your personal obstacles. When you become aware of what's coming from you and what's coming from others, you can separate your thinking from their opinions and eventually uncover your own truths about who you really are. Self-trust now becomes increasingly possible. You realize that it comes down to you, what you're willing to do to get where you want. Self-trust continues to be huge on my own coaching journey. And now I witness others' increased confidence and most importantly, personal integrity. These are key ingredients in self-trust. One of my favorite lines is, that's not my stuff. It's something I realize often when I began separating myself from others' opinions about me in my life. The choice to trust myself burst to the surface and I've not looked at my gremlins quite the same since. So email me gaye dot goyaworks at gmail.com. That's gay.goyaworks at gmail.com. And don't forget to check out my coaching minutes, which are on my site regularly. And thank you very much for visiting.